All right, so we're at the bow now. Got the trolling motor in the water. All right, Meg is down there. That's the little cluster we just went over and I showed you. Tree, tree field, stump field. Not the, not the greatest image, but I think I can still work on that with the settings. So you notice, not on the not on the troll motor at all. So a fairly clear image, right? It works. As soon as I touch this pedal, right? We're steering, right? Put a steering input in there. Completely washes that image out. I'm gonna turn spot lock on. Take a minute for it to. going on there all right so she's working she's running spot lock just completely washes this out right because you got the combination of the thrust button the pedal input right and then the steering inputs as well totally kills this go over to menu here right everybody wants to talk about noise filters so I got this on at noise filter 4 all right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn it off. Show you how it is with it off. Horrible, right? I mean, that's, that's bad, right? Menu. Noise filter, where did it go? Did I pass it? Yeah, I did, sorry. Noise filter one. Set it on one. One's blown out. Number two is better. But it's still not great right so I still got spot lock on right that's why we're still seeing a little bit of a little bit of interference there because it's constantly moving right it's doing its thing Go to noise filter three. This one's really bad. Okay. Menu. Go back to four. All right. Okay. Four seems to be the best, but it's not up to the standards that it needs to be. Right, because what I'm going to do now is I'm going to turn spot lock off, right? Because spot lock's going to do its thing. Right. Spot lock off. Fairly clear image. So we'll run through the noise filters again with this thing turned off, with the spot lock turned off. Oh. Alright, so noise filter will turn off. A little wagon wheeling going. Right, absolutely zero input on the pedal. Control motor's not doing anything. We're not requesting it to do anything. So you can see we're a little bit of washout there. Okay back here go to one again not on the pedal cleans it up a significant amount still every now and again has some of these these little these little tick marks here okay
setting two. Eh, maybe a little worse than one, maybe the same. Try to put a shadow on the screen there so you guys can see the screen better. Anyway, the noise is still there, the interference is still there. We'll go to three. Still get that same noise. Still got them same little tick marks. And we'll go back to four. A little bit of noise, just can't can't seem to get a real, real clear image there. So let me show you. Uh, obviously cables aren't ran, right? So I've got straight off of the mega transducer. I've got uh, the actual train or the, the transducer cable running down, basically completely isolated away from anything to do with troll motor power. Running down the shaft there, or the uh, sorry, the troll motor bracket. And right now I just have this cable kind of freely out of the way, so that way it's not by anything, right? So this comes back over wraps around basically wraps around here just so it's out of the way and it's not coiled up and it comes in here All right here's that same cable I got the ferrite ring on here that you asked me to put on unfortunately I can only get four wraps on there so I'm not sure how much that's helping out and then it goes right into the right into the uh, the connector there about eight, eight inches away I was expecting to be able to put more wraps on that but I couldn't due to the size of the connector like you say I'm not sure how that is affecting or not affecting this so again we'll go back here real quick just put some control motor pedal inputs in yeah and it doesn't matter what speed either on the troll motor I can turn this down and it washes it right out Bump this guy all the way up to 10 plus. There's the interference. Let me get back up to here where we were at. take this guy off a of mega put it on 455 might have to play with my settings a little bit on the 455 kilohertz setting. All the pedal input in the world right here. Control motor on. No issue. Let's see if I can't... Uh, down a bit and turn the sensitivity up right. okay. so again that's on the, the 455 setting zero interference maybe a tad sorry just a tad bit of interference there <laughs> 